All right, guys, welcome back to another one of Mr. Johnson's 101s. Today, we are gonna be going over our primary and secondary colors. We know our primary colors. They're the three colors that make up all the rest of the colors of the rainbow. You know what they are? Sure you do. Red, yellow, and blue. So when you mix two primary colors together, you get the secondary colors, okay? If I have my red over here and I got my yellow over there, I mix them together, I get orange. Let's do two more. So I got my yellow and I got my blue. Mix those together, I get you green. All right, the last two would be red and blue mix purple or violet, same color. So we're gonna put these into two more categories. We have warm colors and cool colors. The warm colors are the colors that are more vivid, more bright, more exciting. They bring out those types of emotions, okay? Just think about fire, okay? When you think about warm colors, just think about warm, the warm sun outside. With the cool colors, these are the colors that are more so associated with you know, mellow, calm, more relaxing. What colors do you think about when you think about water? Now that we understand that our primary and secondary colors are broken up into warm and cool colors, I'm gonna show you guys how to do a quick little project done with the sun. Let's get started. Okay guys, this exercise is really simple. All you really need is just some crayons and a piece of paper. Now I'm gonna take my black crayon and start and I'm gonna draw a circle in the middle of my paper. Now to draw my circle, I'm gonna use a top that I got from my oatmeal container, but you can use a Xbox or PlayStation game. And you can just take your crayon and draw a perfect circle all the way around, okay? Just like this. The right side will be the sun, the left side will be the moon. We're gonna draw a crescent shape down the middle, and we're gonna add a little point to make a nose for our moon. Then we'll draw a little smiley face. And maybe add another line there for the cheek. So let's work on our eyes now. The moon will be sleeping, so we'll do a half of the eye. And you can do an open eye for your son. Just uh, give him a little bit of character. And then we'll do some eyebrows also to, for expression. So next we'll divide up the background for our sun and moon. So let's add some sun rays for our sun. And then we'll add an aura for our moon. So the challenge here is to use warm colors for the sun and cool colors for the moon. Okay, so we're gonna use our red, yellow, and orange to create some different patterns inside of our sun rays. Okay, make sure you fill in all the white space when you color them in, okay? Once you have all the warm colors colored in for your sun and the sun rays, you're gonna do the same thing for the cool side with the moon. So that way you'll have warm and cool colors distinguished. Warm and cool colors. And then you're all done. All right, so now that we understand our primary and our secondary colors and also our warm and cool colors, you guys have a good one. And Mr. Johnson, we'll see y'all next time.